All right, everybody, it's time to take down some zombies. This is Rob News Blog, and welcome to my in theater movie review series. So today's movie I'll be reviewing today is Zack Snyder's film Army of the Dead. And before I get into my thoughts about this film, here are a few words from the channel. All right, everybody, it's time to get on the social media train. Want to chat with me in a hundred words or less? Then check out my Twitter account. Want to talk about movies, TV shows, and video games within the group? Then check out my Facebook account. Want to check out some of my ultra cool fan art? Then check out my Deviant Art page. Want to get the lowdown on everything that's happening on this channel? Then check all of the above. And now we return to our regularly scheduled program. So Army of the Dead stars Dave Bautista and is about how a zombie apocalypse breaks out in Las Vegas and a group of mercenaries ended up going on a bank heist throughout Las Vegas to steal some money but unfortunately they have to deal with the zombies that are affecting Las Vegas at the same time. So when I first heard about this movie I actually thought that this was connected to the Evil Dead series which was a series that starred Bruce Campbell and I never really watched that series before even though I really wanted to and when I thought that it was connected to the Evil Dead series I was a bit hesitant about watching this movie because I was thinking to myself do I have to watch the Evil Dead series to understand this movie but no it wasn't really connected to the Evil Dead series and this is a movie you could watch on its own and another reason why I wanted to watch this movie was because it was directed by Zack Snyder now even though I don't watch a lot of Zack Snyder films I was interested in this film and I wanted to see how well Zack Snyder was able to direct this film and he did a fantastic job with this film so let's talk about some of the things I did like like with this film. First off, I like the premise of the film. So the film is basically about this group of mercenaries trying to perform a bank heist, but they have to do it during a zombie apocalypse, so they have to fight zombies along the way. And I thought that this premise was really interesting because even though I've watched a lot of films that deal with a zombie apocalypse, I never saw a zombie apocalypse film that dealt with a bank heist at the same time. So that's what made this film so creative to me, is that it was a zombie apocalypse film that has a bank heist in the center of the plot. So I found that to be really interesting and I think the film did a really good job at pulling off that plot line in this film. Another thing I liked about this film were the character interactions. I actually thought that I wasn't going to like any of the characters in this film because with zombie apocalypse films they tend to not really develop the characters too well but with this film they actually develop each of the characters and we get to see a lot of interactions between the characters especially with Dave Bautista's character trying to interact with his daughter after all these years and I enjoy seeing the relationship between him and his daughter and how they're trying to survive the zombie apocalypse and I also enjoy seeing Dave Bautista's character interacting with the other mercenaries in his group and how they're friendly with each other as it made these characters so sympathetic and it made me feel bad whenever any of the characters get hurt in this film so I really like the character interactions in this film and then another thing I liked about this film were the action sequences I love the sequences where the mercenaries are fighting against the zombies and they have to shoot them all down just to survive in this apocalypse as it really Really made him to tough and capable characters who are able to handle themselves during the zombie apocalypse and it was just so fun seeing these mercenary characters trying to shoot down the zombies while they're trying to perform this bank heist at the same time now if there was an issue that i have with this film is that sometimes the pacing could get slow in some scenes like there were some moments throughout the film where the pacing was a bit too slow and i was wondering to myself about when is this scene going to move along and when are we going to get to the action sequences so yeah there were some pacing issues with this film that got me a little bored at times and then another issue I have with this film, and this is just a personal issue I have, is that I wish that this film was a little more colorful visual wise. Like after looking at all the promotional material for this film and seeing a lot of colorful details with the characters and the setting they're in, I was expecting this film to have more colorful visual effects to make this film stand out even more. Sort of like the visual effects you see in Birds of Prey where everything looks colorful, especially during the fight sequences. And I kind of wish that this film had the same colorful effects that Birds of Prey had just so this movie would stand out a lot more. So overall, I give Army of the Dead a watch it. Yeah. 
why there were some pacing issues with this film and I wish that this film was a little more colorful visual wise I did have a lot of fun with this film it was great seeing all of these mercenary characters fight off these zombies and I really liked the character interactions between all of the characters and I thought all of the performances were done very well especially Dave Bautista as the main character and so I just had a lot of fun with this film especially since I tend to watch a lot of zombie films and I think that this is one of the most unique zombie films I ever seen so that's my review on Army of the Dead and tell me in the comments down below. Have you seen Army of the Dead? And if you have, did you like the movie? Did you hate the movie? And what zombie movie have you seen that has a very unique premise? Please feel free to tell me in the comments down below. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. This is Rabbit's Blog and I'll see you guys later. <laughs>